Well, the social media trend of stealing Hyundai and Kia vehicles is a major concern for car owners. From 2011 to 2022, approximately 9 million models from the automakers were manufactured without an immobilizer, making them easier to steal. During the first six months of this year, auto thefts are the main driver of overall crime right here in Charlotte. WCNC Charlotte's Jane Monreal has been covering this crime trend for months now. Jane, you've been digging into this today, though you're hearing from one of the city's latest victims. Exactly, Colin. Jason Sam Jr. is his name, and he owns both a Hyundai and a Kia, Colin. So get this, after a month of moving to Charlotte, he became one of the latest victims of this trend, having a, one of his vehicles broken into. I pretty much moved in and there was someone that um, he was moving out. He was like, yeah, have you heard about the Kia Hyundai? And I was like, yeah. And he was like, yeah, you should be safe. Watch out. Jason he, Sam Jr. says he walked out to his car last week and saw this. They rammaged through like the middle console and that's all the stuff on the seat uh -huh. um, and then like stripped the panel. He filed a police report right away. It was like their third or fourth car Hyundai they had seen that day. In their mid-year report, CMPD said auto thefts went up 143% from January 1st to June 30th of this year compared to the same time last year. It's like, what do you say? Um, because I've I seen all the news and coverage about it. I just didn't know that I'd be the next person. Officer is now working on getting the word out to use a steering wheel lock, something that Jason is now doing on his Kia. It's not going to stop my energy with my good energy with this area, but I would just prefer for and someone not to bring it to my car next time. But. Well, he also says he is planning to uh, sell that Hyundai. CMPD always urging residents and affected car owners to lock up your vehicles, store valuables, and park in well-lit areas. We're live at CMPD headquarters in Uptown. Jane Monreal, WCNC Charlotte. Still such a frustrating thing. Appreciate those uh, pieces of advice, though, that you could pass along. Thanks, Jane.